So I've been getting a question a lot lately, actually for the last four years, and that's, uh, as a mini pig owner, do I still eat pork? The short answer is yes. The long answer is yes. We still, we still definitely eat pork, 100% eat pork. And I think the main reason I don't feel guilty about it is that pigs aren't herbivores, they're omnivores. Like if it came down to it, these cute little pigs right here would 100% eat me. I mean, like I'm not their first choice. I'm kind of crunchy. They'd rather have pellets or grass or whatever else. But if we were trapped and I fell over and got hurt and there was absolutely nothing else to eat, they would eat me. There are always those stories out there of farmers getting eaten by, you know, big farm pigs. You know, pigs, those are, they weigh about six times more than gilly when they're bigger. So obviously if they have a little bit easier time, you know, in the wild, pigs will even eat other pigs. Actually, on farms, they'll eat other pigs if they get injured. Mama pigs will eat their piglets sometimes. Uh, pigs are, they're just kind of eating machines. So do I feel guilty about eating pork? Not particularly, especially since I've seen these pigs eat pork. Not on purpose. They kind of, uh, I guess I don't need to be kneeling down here by myself now that all the pigs have left the shot. Let me see if I can find another pig. Here, come over here. Let's go this way. Hey Luna, you hiding from me? You have stage fright all of a sudden? Uh, so anyway, they, uh, they've definitely eaten bacon off the floor or little pieces of sausage when it's fallen. The little pig right there the other day, when, uh, when I, dropped an entire, I dropped an entire burger with pepper jack cheese on it and she gobbled it right up with no hesitation. She feels zero guilt about eating cows. They've eaten chicken nuggets. They've eaten all sorts of other stuff. Uh, they seem to like meat as, as well as anything else. I mean, half their lives are spent trying to steal food from us. And we try really hard not to let them get people food, but they're really smart and they're really insistent. And uh, I have four children who are low to the ground and aren't always super you know, diligent about guarding their food. So they do steal some and we have to kind of take that into account. Uh, it's summer right now, so this is actually when they kind of pork up a little bit because they, uh, there's so much food. They can eat grass outside. You can't really see it right now. There was grass out here before they ate it all down. We tried really hard to grow grass this year. They've got pellets that we spread, and then we've got apples over here. So last year, we ate zero apples. All the apples eventually fell on the ground, either from weather or uh, you know squirrels or whatever else, and the pigs ate every single one of them. This year, we have a chance of actually getting some apples but earlier, I caught my youngest two kids, uh, my six-year-old Lucy and four-year-old Waffle. They were out here picking the apples and feeding them to the pigs, which is why the lower branches do not have very many apples. And eventually, Gilly, as when the apples start to smell better, Gilly will go under them and actually get up on her hind legs and lunge up like a shark, shooting out of the depths, trying to get those apples. So again, she'll eat lots of other food, but if there's meat available, if she steals it, if she finds it on the ground, if somebody spills their entire plate, which happens entirely too often, they will eat meat too. So I thought when I got them, I'd feel guilty about eating pork. It turns out I don't feel any guilt at all. Uh, it helps that pork is delicious. I mean, it, it's just good eating. And I'm actually on the carnivore diet, so I only eat meat anyway. I mostly eat beef, but I do eat some pork as well. Uh, and then there's the fact that uh, pigs are just kind of perfect for eating. It's that's partially their fault. They were that way uh, just through natural selection, but they were also selectively bred for it. If you think about pigs in the wild or pigs on a farm, they have a ton of babies all at once, like 12 to 20 babies. They grow up super fast. In six months, they're that big. The farm pigs are anyway. Within a year, they're ready to go to market. And um, you can feed them virtually anything. So it's no wonder our ancestors found these things. They're like, holy cow, these are perfect for eating. So. Uh, yeah, they kind of got a rough shake there, the pigs did, but that's okay. So anyway, I'm still eating pork. You probably should eat too, uh, but I'm not going to eat these guys. These guys are my pets. There are many pigs. They will be here till they, till they die. They usually live about 20 years. Hopefully they make it that long. We've got four kids. Our house is kind of dangerous. Anyway, that's the answer to your question. Catch you next time.